fewer shots equal protection. New research indicates it could take fewer vaccines to protect women against a cancer causing infection. We're talking about the HPV vaccine right now. It's administered to kids and young teens and requires three doses over a six month period. But this research reveals that may not be the case any longer. News 13's Catherine Mazzone is in the newsplex with the details on this. That's right, Crystal. Researchers say this was an exciting study and could reduce the number of dosages to two, maybe even one. But a UNM researcher who worked on the trial says not so fast. More research may be needed. There is no two doses. There is no one dose. And our data are insufficient to change the policies for administering these vaccines, meaning less than three doses. That's UNM researcher Dr. Cassette Wheeler. She says only the three-dose vaccine is available in the United States, and that's the way it should stay, at least for now. Wheeler says her and her partner's research isn't enough. The samples of women getting one or two doses were not randomized, and there weren't enough of them. She also adds there needs to be testing when it comes to how far apart the first and second dose is administered. It's why Wheeler says while the results are promising, another study needs to be done. Whether these particular available HPV vaccines can be delivered and provide protection with one or two doses equally or better. The two authors of this study stress it's too soon for people to opt out of a second or third dose or for medical professionals to administer anything fewer than three doses of this vaccine. Back to you. All right, thanks, Captain. Now, while research indicates three doses can protect you for up to 10 years, their data for one or two doses only extends for four years.